In this video, I'm going to show you a WebEx calling walkthrough. So WebEx is a cloud-based communication solution designed to streamline voice calling for business. In this video, I'll walk you through everything from creating your account to configuring key calling features. So by the end, you'll be equipped to manage WebEx calling effectively and make the most of its advanced capabilities. So first, what is WebEx Calling? So WebEx Calling, or simply WebEx, is a VOIP-based phone service provided by Cisco, enabling businesses to manage their internal and external communications through the cloud. It offers HD voice quality, advanced call management features, and seamless integrations with collaboration tools like WebEx Meetings and Microsoft Teams. This solution is perfect for businesses transitioning away from traditional phone systems as it's scalable, mobile-friendly, and easy to set up without needing physical infrastructure. So some key features of WebEx is its cloud-based phone system, which makes and receives calls anywhere with an internet connection. Another key feature is call routing and forwarding, voicemail to email, and multi-device support, which access calls from your desk phone, mobile app, or your web browser. So now let's move on to creating an account. So you can sign up for free. Just click here in the top right, sign up, it's free. So I just used my Google account to sign up for an account. And after signing up, you will now be redirected to this page. So you can see, welcome to WebEx. So you can uh, choose to download WebEx and set up your account in their user hub, or you can instead use their web app. So for now, I'm just going to use the web app. And now, as you can see, we are now redirected to their dashboard. So if you don't feel like using the web app, you can always see the download uh, button right here in the top. So now this is how our dashboard should look like. So in the top, you can see search. So you have a workspace right here. So you can search for a workspace that you have created. And also click here and upgrade your WebEx to a premium version. So as you can see, you can download the desktop app right here. You can now add your people. So you can add teammates. So let's click on invite teammates. So you can simply add people by their name or their email. So if they already have a WebEx account, you can simply add in their names. But if you don't have yet, we can simply add in their emails and they will be notified via email. And when they click the link in their emails, they will now be accepting our invitation and be working with us in WebEx. So as you can see here is the messaging. So you'll see all of the messages right here. You'll see the people, content, and meetings. You can also see direct message and spaces. Now let's go back. And from here, we can create a space as well. So spaces work well for a group of people working on a specific topic or project. So let's say we want to create a new spa uh, space. So let's just name it test. Click on create. And as you can see, this is like a new space or simply a new group chat if you're quite confused what a space is. So from here, you can also add people. So you can go to people and add people to your space. Here in contents, you will see all of the files that you have shared with each other. You can also see whiteboards, so you can create whiteboards right here. You can also see meetings. So as you can see, there is a calendar and meeting content. 
So if you want to meet with your group members in this space, you can simply click on meet right here in the top right. And as you can see, you can use your camera and your phone. So let's just go back. So to start a meeting, just click here and all of you should be uh, meeting in this area. So now this is for the messaging feature. Now let's move on to our calendar. So this is the calendar or meetings icon. So from here, you can either start a meeting, you can either join a meeting, and of course, you can schedule a meeting for later. So let's say you have a meeting tomorrow. You can simply schedule a meeting. So from here, just select the date and time, uh, the time zone. You can invite all of the people uh, who should participate in this meeting. You can check the recurrence and you can add the description of what this meeting is all about. You also have this advanced setting right here, which you can see the password, the join rules, auto lock, join before host, audio options, so you use VOIP only, and the schedule options also right here. Next is the calls feature. So from here, you can make a call or join a meeting. So if you want to call only uh, one person, you can always search their name right here, their email or the meeting URL, which they created. And you will see all of your recent calls right here in the left hand side, all of the missed calls. So basically the meetings and calls is just basically the same, but for calls, of course, you can call someone privately. And that's about it. And next is this section, which is teams. From here, you can create your teams. As you can see, find your teams here. A team is a group of people with a similar goal, of course. So it can be your department or the people you work with on a project. So simply click here on the plus icon and create the team that you desire and describe the team also and of course add the people that uh, should join your team and click on create as you can see this is the new uh, space for your team so basically the team and the spaces are almost the same as you can see it's just you just created a new group chat so basically, that's how you can use WebEx. So if you find this video helpful, please hit like and subscribe. Thanks.